starting in mountain pose, taking deep breaths, breathing in there through the nose, inhale, and exhale. Then we find the head reaching to the ceiling, extending the fingertips strongly towards the floor. Inhale, reaching up and overhead, back bending into volcano pose, and on the exhalation, swan diving into a softening forward fold. Inhale, circle sweep up to volcano. Exhale, swan diving, forward fold. And notice the movement of the arms here. This ensures that we're keeping our liver lengths a little bit shorter and safer, and keep the knees bent as you come into your forward fold. This is just warming up the body. And exhale, hinging from our hips. Inhale, we're taking the hands behind the back, lacing the fingers, and then lifting the shoulders on the exhalation, opening up into a chest expansion. So now you're unsupporting your forward fold, bend your knees a little more if you need to. Deep breath in hand, and exhale. Now on this inhale, reach yourself back up, and as we exhale, release the fingertips down. And then moving into our lateral side bending. So inhaling. Sweeping the arm up and overhead. On the exhale, closing the arms down. Allow your gaze to follow the moving hand. And just stay long and extended, reaching away from center. The emphasis in this workout is on the back bending, but we do balance spinal movements. Both hands are inhaling up, and on this exhalation, twisting and releasing through. So as we inhale, lengthen through the spine, initiate the twist. On the exhale, develop the twist. Moving from the belly, tension of the Exhale, swan diving into a forward fold. As we inhale, lengthening through the spine, gazing up, monkey pose. Exhale, hinging deeper into forward fold. Inhale, circle sweep up to standing. And on the exhalation, sitting back to chair pose. Inhale, circle sweep up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, lengthening through the spine, monkey pose. Exhale, deepening into the forward fold. Inhale, circle sweep back up. And exhale, sitting back, chair pose. Again, inhaling. And moving through the flow once again, warming up the big muscle groups. And just releasing and deep into the spine. Exhaling, releasing deep into the forward fold, moving through the hips. Inhale, circle sweep up. And exhale, chair pose. Inhale, circle sweep up. Exhale, swan back down. And now we gently transition, coming down into quadruped position, all fours. Placing the hands under the shoulders, knees underneath the hips. We inhale, drawing up through the core. And then exhaling, rinding through the spine. So inhaling, lifting through the chest here into cow pose. And then exhaling, rounding through the spine into cat. Just going through each of these poses, letting the head and neck follow the movement of the spine. Deep, easy breathing. Inhaling. And exhaling. Now this time as we inhale, lengthening through the leg, lifting the chest, and on the exhalation, draw the knee to the forehead. Inhale, lift up again, and then exhale, set the knee down, switching sides. Inhale, and then exhale, knee towards the forehead. Inhale, lift up, exhale, release down, switching sides. So this is a flowing sunbird, staying strong through the core, opening up through the hips, exhale, and coming down. The body here and again, still putting our attention and focus on one of the spine. The belly for back bend. Exhale, forehead towards the knee. Inhale and lengthening, and exhale and sit down. Then one more on the side. And sit down. Now, as we exhale, we'll set the back here into extended child's pose, placing fingertips into the mat, bringing the shoulders down, sending the hips back towards the heels. Releasing shoulder blades down your back, we inhale and exhale up. Now moving into a modified plank on the exhalation, lowering to the mat, 
as we inhale, lift the chest for small cobra, and then as we exhale, sitting back to extend the child's pose. Lower again, inhale, lift the modified plank, exhale, lower to the mat. Inhale, lift the chest to small cobra, and exhale, coming back. So a modified version here of the traditional half season. And again, always an option if you're just starting out. Next here, we're demonstrating what the full option looks like. Bring up the toes, lowering to a high lung exhalation. Inhale, lifting up with facing dog, and on the exhalation, raising back down with facing dog. And just letting that flow, keeping the core strong. Lifting the chest for up dog, and as we exhale, sitting back into down dog. Just settling in here. Strong for the core, the full time. Thank you. 